also want my core and I'd want, like him to stop attacking other people so this is definitely what I want do I have this occupied yes let's go ahead and give this to over to the Mamluks that's probably all that they want no they want more well fuck me we need to occupy Asahlalala. And he doesn't want any of the rest, so I have to give him these two. No, 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 no. Okay, thank you. <laughs> that looks sweet. Alright, so how about... Yeah, okay, now he's fine. And then this deal, this deal is fine too. And I'll accept this deal. We'll make this deal. This deal is a-okay. Please succeed! Thank you. Right, so the Mavlogs are happy campers, we're happy campers. Uh, might want to do things a little bit differently here, because fuck Ganja and fuck Moosh. And uh, screw Van. No. No, not screw Van. How about we screw Melikatus? And magically I'm allowed to take this, but. That, that, that shit aside. Can I take Ermia? No. Right, hold on. Hold the phone here. Can I take Mosul? And then do... Wait, what's cheaper? No, we can't take Sinjar because it's next to the province that you want. So how about we take this, that. Can we take... No, we can't. We get upset. Yeah, this is what I want, exactly. But then we don't have Yerevan, unfortunately. Yeah, how about I take Sinjar instead, but I think that's gonna piss him off. So is Ermia or Marigag more expensive? Marigag's more expensive. <coughs> yeah, hold on, let's do it differently again. How about I do Van, Ermia, Yerevan? Yay! No, but now I don't have Mosul. Fuck! <laughs> God damn it! Now I don't have Mosul. Fuck you, man! Look, fuck you. Hey, right, so we can't take Mosul. Then I say let's not. Let's just take this. And be on our merry way. <laughs> yeah, okay. <coughs> right, this fort is pointless, so we'll get rid of it. This fort is quite useful, but it's too expensive, so we're getting rid of it. Let's see if we can't doubt Tiberistan. Now Karakunjulu would actually join. Wow, unbelievable. Might I have to doubt this guy, but we have to wait one tick of the month before we can uh, actually enter that. And I'm frantically trying to conquer these people. Uh, because I'm too afraid of other shit. Oh, he's actually, he's allied. Uh, Georgia is allied Trabazon, so we can eat Trabazon now. Uh, do I want to eat Shervan first, though? That's the question. Yeah, Artibles for a border with Tabir Sam. Yeah. Oh, I will fight them. 
with Karakunyulu, uh, without waiting for the tush with Karakunyulu to be over. But I want my course to finish. So now it's a question of, am I going to fight Shirvan first, or am I going to fight Georgia first? I think I'll fight Shirvan first, it's an easier war. Uh, so let's do it. <clears throat> Alright, let's get those guys in there, and I need to see each guy, and there's no way we can do a trick to make sure that we can enter that faster. Wait a bit, he'll revoke the guarantee since he lost the border. Oh, wow. You were right on the money there. Well, we'll declare that war after we finish this up then. Because certainly, if you can grab this bit, you have like 50% of the trade power in Persia. Now that's a lot of money, okay? That will bankroll my war with the Ottomans. Oh shit, I shouldn't have done that. Oh shit. Okay, never mind, fuck it. Because if I let him live, he's gonna get killed. First, I gotta go deal with Shervan. Okay. And thankfully, the Ottomans declared war on Venice, so you won't have to deal with any of that. No, my air died! My god, air! He was so good at fighting. <laughs> at least he didn't die in battle. I mean, the chances of that were pretty high. Nah, I'm not gonna bird him dying. I mean, come on. What I am gonna do is give some more land over to these nice people. And we're gonna resist. Ask for a minister. I'm gonna give them one more province. And then we're gonna demand some manpower from them. Bird is the Windows feature. <laughs> okay, so this war is pretty expensive, but that's because Shirvan had the stupid fort right on top of the thing, so. Those mercs into Mazadran with the super siege leader. 
you guys can go into that. We are gonna get deleted and we're gonna stop paying for our troops. Alright, sweet. Also, Shirvan, I'm gonna peace you out. I'm just gonna take the money. Fantastic. Alright, let's get rid of this fort. Yeah, might wanna burn the land first. And then we're gonna quit out. Ottomans want military access. I'm thinking, yeah. Nah, I'm thinking. Nah, not today. That's what I'm thinking. Auto potato. <laughs> yeah, he appears to be losing that war against Venice, Corfu, Knoxville, Ravensburg, the Knights, Augsburg, Alsace, Genoa, and Siena. Now, how about we add the Ottomans? I mean, the Mamluks and the thingy bald of the lava to that. Oh, he, oh, he doesn't want any of the land. Shit. No, he does! He does want some of the land. I like how they call you in and offer to give you land then. That doesn't make any sense. Fuck this game, doesn't have Bali Kassir in the map. I wish I knew where it is. Be the defender of kebab and share kebab towards Europe. I'll tell you what I'm gonna share kebab, I'm gonna slaughter kebab. <laughs> there can only be one, and that is me, and I am Turkish culture, so I am the true kebab, okay? None of this Osmanoglu nonsense. Oh, Akundulu will reign supreme, both over black sheep and and the, the, this pretender rebel. Sultan of Rum, don't make me laugh. Don't make me laugh. He's been drinking too much rum. That's that. That's why he's been saying such weird things. Bastard, scumbag, idiot, banana. That's what he is. He's a banana. And you know what they say about bananas? You have to punch them in the face. Punch them in the face. Really hard and loud and, and, and amazing. You know, that's what you have to do with bananas. That's that's kind of what people do with bananas. If you don't do that with bananas, then there's something incredibly wrong with you. Can I take this land without dying? I can. Fantastic. Right, let's take this land and all of his money too. Okay. And then let's burn it to the ground. Fantastic. Also, I thought they had a fort in Mesogram. For some reason, I thought they had a fort in Mesogram. Turns out I could have done that with a lot less troops than. Kunyulu is a thing now, and who else? Gold Nord? No, I don't want to set the Gold Nord as a thing. Let's set Genoa as a thing. Genoa! Because Genoa just doesn't cut it. Now, you're still losing this war. You're still very much losing this war. But I can't see why. Oh, I can. It's because of the blockade. And because the defender controls Negroponte. But he's winning the battles. But it's only been nine. Now, how about me calling in the Mamluk? Oh, that, that could work, but then we have to fight Tunis as well. But Tunis... <coughs> Tunis is getting wrecked in terms of war exhaustion, so they're gonna be peace outable really fast. So... So... I think... I think we're gonna have 55 rebellions in this area. And I don't know if we can deal with that. That's a penis, I mean a problem. <laughs> Akunulu is a Kurdish country, not a Turkish country. Uh, jokes on you, my primary culture is definitively Turkish. And I didn't even change anything about that. I mean, yeah, sure, the people that lived here are Turkish. I mean, Kurdish. But uh, my primary culture is definitely Turkish. <coughs> the primary culture of Cyprus, for example, is not Greek, but it's 
Frenchian because the ruling class is French. And so this here dynasty I got, this Ak Kunulu dynasty, is apparently Turkish. But maybe they did that for balance reasons. I don't know. I don't care. I just want to play the game. But really, I don't know how to proceed here. Raise autonomy and set a billet. That was some aggressive expansion in 11 years. Yeah, well, we had to. We need to get money somewhere. Because <coughs> we've tried fighting the Ottomans straight away and that didn't work. But I'll tell you something else. The longer you wait with crippling the Ottoman, the stronger he gets. And he's at war with Venice right now, and that's making me feel like, okay, maybe, maybe we can fight him now. But then again, there's a lot of rebellions, and how far are we in debt? Because we're in debt. We're 316 dockets in debt. Now, that's not bad. That could be worse. And, you know, we could get bigger. We could fight uh, Gazik Muk, and then we can get bigger. We can also fight Georgia and eat Trebizond still, and eat Georgia, and eat Gazi Kamuk, and then go fight the Ottomans, but by that time he'll have Tech 6, and we can keep up with him in terms of Tech 6. Sort of, maybe, because we've got our focus on that, but uh, it's the, the thing is, the oh, I don't need this guy, absolutely not, but uh, the thing is, the, the Mamluks, the Mamluks can't. <coughs> There's no way the Mamluks can keep up with him. Now, we know he's pretty far away from Tech 6, because uh, we're nearing Tech 5. Now, he does have a better military leader, but I've had my focus on that, so our overall gain... I mean, he's not that close to Tech 6, right? We're somewhat even. So, the question remains... The thing is, the, the Mamluks have no manpower. The Mamluks have next to no manpower. Then again, neither do the Alter Potatoes, and they only have 56k. And what can we get? We've got 17. But, you know, the thing, he's at war. Oh my god. See, there's, there's shit like this going on. I rate my chances for winning this war 50-50. Depending on how terrible these rebellions are going to be. <sighs> so cute seeing him speaking of the Mamluk as if they're going to be any help at all. Yeah. No, I think we have to deal with the rebellion first. It's it's so not the way I play this game, but we've already died seven times. See, if this was attempt number one, I don't even, I wouldn't even think about dying the Ottomans right now. I just do it. But if not, we have to declare war on something else because we're a horde, so we have to fight. Otherwise, we go bankrupt. So I'm gonna go for a piss, and then we'll uh, we'll fight Gazikamuk or something. And wait until the rebellions happen.
if he vassalizes Georgia, A, they will be highly likely be disloyal because he annexed, raised, released. And they won't have 10k anymore since they won't have very hard bonuses for being a player vassal. <sighs> so if you quit and play your backup, then you will get three save files so you can try fighting the auto and if you're failed can open the example backup backup. Yeah, but you could just go into your save files, make a copy and do that. Wash my hands, I did. The uh, toilet's quite close. Least Tiberistan, feed them Shia land. Oh no, certainly not. I uh, can tell you why too, because Persia, I own every important center of trade in every estuary in this land right now. So I'm going to make a lot of money here. And I'm certainly not going to ruin that whole gibbery jack by releasing uh, Persia. Certainly not. In fact, because this guy is not collecting from trade here, that means we basically... 64% of the trade power is being retained, and we're going to collect almost all of it because the only person that's collecting from trade here is Artelan. <coughs> so we'll really make a lot of money here. Because Timmy isn't doing anything with this money. Florida, wait to fight the authors to take land quicker and they can take it off you. Ah. Oh. I honestly don't know what to do here. I'm also pretty tired, so I think I'm gonna make a lot of mistakes. If I keep playing this right now. I think we made a great start today. We're, we've got a nice start, you know, we've got barely any loans. We've got 300 dockets in debt, but I've got 260. So we're only 50 dockets in debt, really. I mean, really. So I think, you know, we made a nice solid start this time. I'm not gonna fuck it up, I, uh... Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, the Toots and the Gorda is doing well. How in the hell? How did you lose that? Who, did, who are you allied with? Denmark and the Livonian Order? You got beaten by Denmark, Common Blob? Commonwealth? Really? You got beaten by Denmark? Oh, shame, shame, ugh. Oh, oh, that is disgusting. Yeah, I don't know. But uh, anyway, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave you with that for today. I think, and uh, see you guys again on the Tuesday. And let, let's let's actually make a <laughs> streaming schedule or something. So what's I need like an agenda? Can I can I get like the dates? Okay, so on Tuesday, the first of November. At 1900 hours Central European time, I should probably write this down. No. Anyway, this Tuesday we're going to continue with this, right? We're going to continue with uh, EU4 and Akundulu. Then what we're going to try and do is I'm going to stream on Thursday, and on Thursday, because Thursday this is heartland of people anyway, so Thursday we're going to do Civ 6, and then on Saturday and Sunday we're going to do EU4 again. So I'll do the th 
Thursdays is EU uh, Sif Sif six days, but that's only for four weeks because I think I can finish that finish every run in one session. But we'll see. Doesn't matter. Uh, but yeah, I want to do all four victory types and make like a guide ship type deal for that. So there's that. And um, yeah, that'll basically be that. What happened to Kaffa? I finished that. We got the, the achievement. I wanted to up the ante halfway through the game by going for one faith, but I didn't think we could make that in that particular game. So then we were gonna do Baba Black Sheep, but I noticed that Akundulu can't do back by Baba Black Sheep. Because you need to be Kat Akundulu for that. But we wanna also be Coptic. And I didn't want to play as Kata Kunjulu because it's so easy. It's stupid. He starts like yay big. I never do that. It's dumb. So yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys again on Tuesday. 1900 hours Central European time. And... Um... Oh, Nyankan. Thank you for the host. But I'm about to call it quits. No Halloween stream dressed as a historical figure. Oh, I thought about that, but I didn't really have a nice costume. Take my money! <laughs> I tip my hat off to you, sir. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, thank you so much for watching, and please be sure to check out my YouTube channel. I'm feeling good about this playthrough, so this will all be uploaded to YouTube. Uh, I think this will be a lot of fun because we're smacked in between all these big powers. It's fun times. Anyway, um, yeah, that'll be that. So, thank you. Have a bye.